we will address how to use the Carnot map for logic simplification. In the previous video, we saw how to produce a Carnot map for four input variables. We now address how to use this as a tool for obtaining the minimal sum of product expression. As discussed in previous videos, each product term of the expression is represented on the map by a 1, 2, 4, or 8 cell bag. For SOP reduction, we want to cover the ones in the map with the fewest bags possible. Furthermore, the larger the bag, the simpler the product term. Thus, we also need to cover the ones with the largest bags possible. For the given map, the largest bag that can be constructed consists of the eight cells connected in a wraparound. This bag corresponds to the B-bar term. The largest bag that covers the remaining ones is the C-bar D term. Note that bag overlap is permitted. Then we place the A-bar D bag and finally the A-bar C-bar bag. Because we have chosen the fewest largest bags to cover the ones, we now have the minimal SOP expression for the given map. We compare this result with the original SOP expression used in the previous video to generate the map. In this case, the first two terms are unchanged. The reduction served to absorb the more complex terms into simpler terms. The Carnot map is therefore a powerful tool for logic simplification in situations involving two, three, or four input variables.